Hello, this is Leo at Li Tai. Santilla asiatica has a long history being used as a medicinal herb, and even a large volume of modern research explores its uh, pharmacological function, including antioxidant, help improve the wound healing, improve the collagen, anti-inflammatory, and help improve the memory. In today's video, I'll introduce you the best of four ways to extract Santilla asiatica at home. Before explaining the ways of extraction, I want to introduce you the chemical composition of a Santilla asiatica. Within Santilla asiatica, there are two groups of chemicals, the volatile compounds and the non-volatile compounds. The volatile compounds, they can vaporize during the distillation because of the heat and water extraction and they will go into the essential oil or hydrosol. And the other group, the non-volatile compound, will stay in the Santilla asiatica during the distillation. But they can be chemical extracted, such as a tincture or infusion. Within Santilla asiatica, volatile compounds, there are two major chemicals. One is beta carophyllene and alpha humulene. Both of the, these beta carophyllene and alpha humulene they have a good antioxidants. They can balance those radicals we can, which can cause the aging of the cells. And also they are good antibacteria, antimicrobial, and anti-inflammation. Within the non-volatile compounds, the major group of chemicals called a saphonium. They are triterpenoid. And there are two famous chemicals, azeotic acid and acetical acid. Both of the chemicals have a good function of wound healing, improve the collagen, and also anti-inflammation, and improve the brain function, and help reduce the depression. For the different chemicals, we have a different ways to extract. Now I'm going to the, introduce you the extraction methods. You can easily do it at home. The first way is to make a tea. It's the most easy way to do it at home. Tea is a water infusion method, but unfortunately most of the act active chemicals within the Santilla asiatica has a low water solubility, so this makes it not efficient. But because it's easy to do and it take less time, so you can do more times in the day. Every time you have a little benefit, but with time you get more benefits. In order to have a better extraction, we can also use a blender. The second way is a steam distillation. Please watch my last video about steam distillation of a Santilla asiatica. Steam distillation is a way to separate the volatile compounds out of a, the medicinal herb. Santilla asiatica has a very low essential oil composition. It is lower than 0.03%. So that's why we normally just make a, a milky hydrosol. The hydrosol has a dissolved volatile compounds. This is perfect for working as a skin spray, hair spray. The third way is a tincture. Asiatic acid and asiatic acid both have a higher solubility within arsenal compared with water. It's a hundred times higher. So by using arsenal, we can make the extraction faster and more efficient. The mass ratio is one to five. That means if you have a 10 gram of a Santilla asiatica and then use a 50 gram of uh, the alcohol. Shake well, upside down, and shake and make sure all of the leaf got soaked by the arsenal and then leave for two weeks in the shade and the room temperature. And then you can drain the alcohol out and use it. For the tincture, you can either drink a, a teaspoon a day, but obviously it has a very high alcohol concentration. It won't be comfortable for everybody. And also you can use a massage. Uh, if you have an arthritis pain, then use this. 
um, because as the article asset has a good uh, pain relief. The last method is uh, after the two weeks the, the tincture making and then we can do the hydro distillation. By doing the hydro distillation, there are two benefits. The first, we separate the alcohol out of the extract. So it becomes a low alcohol or even no alcohol within the extract. It becomes more comfortable or suitable for a larger group of uh, uh, people. The second, during the hydro distillation, it's also additional water extraction. And in the next video, I will show you the hydro distillation of this Santilla as Arica tincture. Hopefully you learned something today and uh, subscribe to the channel of Lee Time. This is Dr. Liu and I'll see you next time.